I'm Donna Ruco and you're on the list. The rich and famous will pour into town this month for two high profile events. Brian McElhatton takes a look around Phoenix. At number one. I'm angry that I live in a world where a man who picks your food can't feed his family. That, as you know, inspired farm leader Cesar Chavez to crusade for farm workers' rights. And tomorrow, Hollywood comes to the Orpheum to premiere a movie that tells the tale. This is what we came here to do. You'll recognize stars like America Ferreira, John Malkovich. And while we don't know if they'll be at the premiere, we do know actor and director Diego Luna and the son of Chavez are expected to attend. You can't oppress someone who's not afraid anymore. At number two, whether you can win or not in a fight that's important, get caught trying. And during the Clinton Global Initiative Conference later this month at ASU, the who's who of media and politics will engage millennials and encourage them to make the world a better place. On the A-list, Jimmy Kimmel, Wikipedia founder Jimmy Wales, Mark Kelly and Gabby Giffords, and John McCain. The three-day conference begins March 21st. It's always exciting to just walk through this forest of ideas. At number three. They sure give me a look. <laughs> Here's a strange Arizona fact. A small band of Havasupai Indians living at the bottom of the Grand Canyon get their mail delivered on the backs of mules. The most sought after postal route of them all. The air is so dewy sweet you don't even have to lick the stamps. It's kind of like the Pony Express, but much slower. A three hour trek in and a three hour trek out every day. And also, uh, we can go in all types of weather. This story makes our list because it's on today's edition of the Huffington Post, along with little known facts about all the other states. Now you're caught up and clued in around Phoenix. I'm Brian McElhatton.